Yeah. How many tractors do you have up here? All together? Run, good, not finished, and unfinished. Good, bad, and the ugly. I think there's 47 or 48. How'd you happen to start collecting those? You grew up with them, or? Nah, it's a long story. You got time? Sure. We'll get the Reader's Digest version. All right. The short story is. When I started, I had an H tractor and I bought a rotor beater to chop great big old Ontario tops. Wouldn't pull it. My dad's best friend was Freddie McBride and he had a brand new 333. Yeah. He said, tell him to use it. Well, now that I'm old and don't know any better, I got thinking I want to I want one of them to restore it. So I found one in Canada, restored it, and just didn't know enough to stop. How many are you missing in the collection? You must have pretty much complete collection. Pretty, pretty well. Pretty well, all of the models. Where do you find them, though? Rock they come, tiles. They come, yeah, they've come. I got them in PEI, Quebec, Ontario, Michigan, Wisconsin, Father's Ways, Kansas. How long does it take to get them all transported up to, say, the Holton Fair or other places? Oh goodness, uh, it'll take a day to get them, get everything down here. We we started Saturday morning and we were worked yesterday and we're still going this morning so do polish them and all that stuff that's great and uh, the wardrobe you got a few red shirts going on here yep yeah that's just everybody's got a hobby and that's what you collect right that's great no money invested just a couple books of green stamps to get that's a couple right. of these that's all there is to it. <laughs>